under a toy megaphone and came to the river to convince people to buy the ISOM trading cards. I don't think this shit is working. I decided to use my friends David Shilly right, comments this on the cards okay, to sell them properly. God, this is so fucking third grade art. Darren Fontano. Height six foot. So he's the same height as your fucking hero. And he's 190 pounds. So he's only 10 pounds lighter. Oh, we know where this guy was born. He was born in Flores Park. And he first appeared in ISOM number one in April 2022. So ooh, we get the whole lore of this guy. I don't generally like to keep up with people that aren't special in terms of their abilities. Then why the fuck did you make a card? But Darren Fontano is a person of interest because the power he has isn't related to his physicality. Uh, he's one of the richest men in Texas, and he's certainly one of the most respected men in Flores Park. Club Merck is one of many properties he owns, and I've seen some of the world's biggest shot callers make appearances there. Oh, God. Uh, other gangsters rarely disrespect him and even accepts fear him okay uh the scary thing is that nobody knows why he has amassed so much power what are his motives oh my god what the fuck are we talking about here dude the day he has political aspirations will be the day that he fully controls this entire city Hmm. Okay. For a guy with such a questionable moral compass, you wouldn't believe it if you hear the way people discuss him. You wouldn't believe it if you heard the way people talk about him. So, power observations. The local police let him do whatever he wants, and the local politicians praise him as if he's a humanitarian. Yeah, he's got lots of fucking money, Eric. We, we, we get it, dude. We fucking understand. Uh, oh my God. Chat, 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 chat. This is, you guys are torturing me with these fucking cars.